I'm at the beach, Pacific Beach, and I've got a Walmart, Dollar Tree, and some thrift haul. Didn't find anything great, but a little bit of stuff. Walmart was always good. They have these for what? Were these 86 cents? I think. Something like that. Which is excellent. Mr. Retro likes these. And what else did I get? I never get to go to Walmart that much, so it's always exciting. Oh, I get the, I get these. I'm gonna leave one down here. These are good for the dogs too. If they start to get upset stomachs, you can give them a squirt of this. And it usually settles their stomach down. So that was good. This was four something for two of these, which I thought was excellent. And this oh, creamers for down here. I think these were two something. I just like the plain regular and a hundred vitamin C's for two something, I think. So that's cool. Oh, I got one of these cool combs. A back combing comb. See? Volume comb. It's a fro comb. Fro it's not a fro comb. And then I got some this. So I can do some major boosting and volume injection with a fabulous comb. So we, we will see. I'm kind of hair challenged. So we'll see if that does anything. Then this one, was this just one bag at Dollar Tree? I guess so, huh? Like, yeah, um, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, I got one of these pretzel snack things and I actually found some of these jerky things so Mr. Retros is going to try these I'm not so much on that and then they have these these nice nut mix deals I don't usually see these at home those are kind of cool and I got a nice backcombing brush and some uh, ponytail thingies. And these are the good kind that don't have the metal dealies because those metal deals will just rip your hair out. So 20 of these is pretty good. And what else? Oh, batteries. Mr. Retro's got himself some batteries. We go through batteries like uh, savages. And they have Wet n Wild. This is a creme brulee. This looks like it would be a nice base coat color for shadow. So that's what I got the tree. Then I hit, I can remember what I hit. Let me try this last one. This was, what was that place called? It was oh, a, three R's thrift. Three R's thrift, which I yeah. don't know what that means. Mm -hmm. It was a church. Tray of portable trailers. It was a portable and they were running, they were, had the thrift store helping to finance their food bank situation so that was cool but they didn't have a lot of stuff so i tried i got this cetaphil cleanser just a little bit of it for 50 cents i'm gonna leave it down here this is the only so kind of soap i can use because i'm allergic to everything and see mr retro's got this guitar tuner. guitar tuner thing oh and everything was half price oh so i guess that was a quarter gosh yeah. so this was Four and a yeah. quarter. Right. So he's going to test this out. Box. It's new and oh, it's Radio Shack. Mm -hmm. So he's going to try and test this out. And he's got batteries to do it. Yay. Then I got some fabrics. The fabric was all $2. So, oops, sorry. I'll try to get this situated better. This is just some rayon, pokey dot, rayon fabric that I can use to fill in when I do my grasses. These I got, what is, see this is the trouble when you're doing doll designing, you're buying the used stuff, you have to buy these big chunks. You can't just buy a half a yard. So this is really nice. That's from the Singer Company. Oh, you know, they used to have Singer stores where they sold fabric. This is like a wool knit jersey. Which I thought would be great for my dolls for their little stretchy dresses. This is fabulous. 
this would make a wonderful caftan for my Savine doll. Look at that. Look at the color combo. It's just, ooh, I like it. Mm -hmm. I like it. And vintage wool felt, which I can always use. I have a felt stash. So that was all I found at that 3R's joint. That's the best I could do, you know. First time in there. First time I've ever been in there. Then, oh, we went to the Salvation Army downtown. Aberdeen. Aberdeen. And I got this fire king set for $3.99. It's got four cups, two saucers, two bowls, and four... Oh no, three plates with the wheat pattern. So yeah, I thought that was kind of cool. And it's Fire King. I don't know if you can read it. Let's see. Oh, it, can you see it at all? Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of hard to see. But it's Fire King. So that's kind of neat. I'm glad it's all taped together. Put that one back in there. And we'll go, oh, this is the other stuff I got there. This, oh, same place, so they turn me. I got this neat canister. Oh, this was marked like blue tags were what, 50%, either 50 yeah. or 75% off. So mm -hmm. I think I got this for a quarter or less. It's just a little canister thing, and I thought I might use this here to store my cups in mm -hmm. because it's vintage and it's nice. So that will stay here. And, oh, this. 99 cents. These are party light tea lights. So I'll leave these down here too. That one's missing a wick. Mm -hmm. And this I thought was. This is a vintage dish. Oh, it's a Syracuse. It was 29 cents. So I thought that was nice. This is so cute. I'm going to leave this down here. I have a bunch of shelves with little cute things on it. Look at how cute that is. It's a kitty cat. It's a salt shaker, but it's made in Germany. So I'm assuming, since it just says Germany, that was before the war. It has another mark oh. here, too. Don't you think? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think so. It's got that funny butterfly mark. Which I can't oh. remember what that is. But this will be cute down here. Oh. Yeah, people oh. love these. <laughs> Every one of these little goofy things I've gotten, I've sold. I've gotten, I've done Lousy Apartment mm -hmm. and, uh, is it Trailer? Mm -hmm. Another trailer. So, this was 99 cents. Oh, this is a nice vintage one. Mm -hmm. Made in Japan. So... That one is nice. And this bowl, it sort of mimics the Tupperware bubble bowl. It's a nice, pretty turquoise. And it's a Betty Crocker bowl, which I'm not familiar with that. What does that say on there? Oven? This is, I can't read what it says underneath there, but. It's a nice bowl for $1.99. Betty Cracker. Now, that's, that was at the Salvation Army. I hit Thrift City. Nothing. Oh Couldn't find a thing. Then I hit Dream Thrift. Nothing. Oh, I found more fabric at Salvation Army. This was $1.09 for all these pieces. This is vintage... Jersey knit, really nice. And this is just some black fleecy stuff and some vintage taffeta lining. This was a dollar nine for this stuff. And let's get that one. Let's see. What else? Ew. This is, this is 
the Goodwill, which I usually don't find anything at the Goodwill. But I found this stuff at the Goodwill. 99 cents for I love Tupperware. It's got a pink one. See, I like, I'm after this pink one. So, 99 cents on a Tupperware. And this is a piece of, let's see, I'll get this guy up. I was looking for a white canister, and I'm going to write something on there. So this was $3.99. It's just a white canister thing. This is vintage fabric. It feels like silk, but I'm not sure if it is. It was not only $0.99. Cents. It might be acetate. I don't know. But it's a good piece, good size piece. It's vintage and it's pretty. And then I if you miss it. I need to get this guy out of here. Yeah, I need a knife cutting this guy open. This is a bag of stuff Mr. Retro's got. Four ninety nine. Get this guy open. I'm cutting myself. There. Okay. Oh, let's see. This. Ew. Uh, these. Nah. Nah. These. Nah. Some of this is going to be donated back. Oh, this I'll leave down here. Oh, That's nice. a brand new gloss. But we wanted these colognes. Oh, this looks like it's almost full. Splash on, brute. Let's give it a smell. Oh, it does. You can just, yeah. It just, ooh, it just takes you right Retro back. Retro Yeah, yeah. And this is mint in the box. What is this called? It's in some weird language. Fine cologne. Hmm. P.S. Parfum. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Oh, scratch and smell. That's long gone. I don't know. Mm -hmm. It's for men. So, we'll see. We'll research that. This is Stetson. It's almost full. Let me smell it. Can't get the... Ugh, I can't get it off. I gotta use grippies to get it off. This is Perceive by Avon. So we'll see. Oh. Oops. This looks like. Huh. That's kind of. Oops. That's kind of neat. Hold it still. See, it's got uh. the bottom under here. Oh, I huh. guess it goes like this. There. Oh, cool. That's kind of cool. Let me smell. Yeah, I'm afraid to spray it. That's kind of mm. neat. With the box. I don't know. Avon doesn't, you know. Yeah. And what's this one? Oh, Royal Copenhagen. This stuff is really neat. This is an old school thing. It's like canoe. Let's see. And, well, it's like they're glued shut. I'm not going to try and open these. I'm afraid I'll spill them. I'll smell these later <clears throat> and write a report. And this is some soap. Avon soap. Oh, no, it's not soap. It's a little teeny travel one. You can leave that one down here. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Soap. Oh, these are hotel soaps. I recognize this. What hotel was this? Uh, I'm not sure. And this one. Orange Valencia. So, that's cool. That's a good... Or $4.99. That's pretty good. Some good stuff in there. So, and... So, that was at the Goodwill. And this is what I got. 
in Shores yesterday, there was nothing at the senior center and nothing at what's that other place? Mm. Flea market finds. Couldn't find a thing. Anchor thrift. So this is it from Anchor Thrift. I actually really needed snaps. So I was thrilled. Oh, and this is a <laughs> Mr. Retro's item because he says you never know when you're gonna need these. Yeah. Seriously. Well, your tips. You, know. you just don't know. So if you need a tip, you know who to talk to. Mr. Right. Retro's. You can have a conversation about that. Snaps. They're two bits. Two bits. Seventy-five cents. I really, really needed these because I was gonna buy some at Walmart. Yeah, I didn't have to. And uh, these. This is so awesome. <laughs> I just couldn't help myself. I couldn't control myself. I, I have a, a dish devil. towel. That's a devil pixie. Oh, it's a devil pixie <laughs> holding a pie. <laughs> telling you to be quiet. Shh. Don't tell anyone. Don't tell anybody. <laughs> oh, keep it to yourselves. <laughs> so that was a dollar. I like that. And, oops, Mr. Retro's got this belt. It looks like a good one. Yeah, Is it okay. all leather? Yeah, I think so. For $5. Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. Belt. And I got fabric. This is really nice. You know, I feel like I have some of this. Really nice. But this would make an awesome fish dress for Savane. And lining. This is just plain old, you know, lightweight stuff for lining. It's like a, kind of like a crepe de chine. And this director has found a shirt. It's just a short sleeve, light blue shirt. And I think it was like $2 or something. Mm -hmm. So that's it. That's what I found down here. I did a little blog thing, so I'll post that too. So I will see you later. Let's see that. Octopus back there. Oh, he wants to see the octopus. We have this awesome this out of the way. Mm. octopus candelabra. Where'd you get that? That my sister in law got this at Marshall's in Aberdeen. In Aberdeen. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah, it's really cool. And then she got a look at him a standing up one too. Mm. But she took that one home. So, it looks cute here, and I, I have it on this table. I put it in the middle of this table. So, that's my story. Bye-bye.